welcome back to my channel today we are going to crochet this easy stitch um, it has minimal yapping for well we're on winter now but it's going to be good for garments uh, or anything that has a right side and a wrong side so this is the right side and this is the wrong side uh, we will be using chain single crochet double crochet and we have a treble um, here is a sample of a solid color if you will want to work in a solid color and an option for stripes the yarn that i am using today is the baby bee sweet delight this one is angel and this one if i'm not mistaken is celery so uh, it requires first, these are the specs of the yarn uh, requires a 4.5 millimeter hook size 3 light and I am using a size 4 millimeter hook I think the design shows better with a smaller hook and if you're ready to learn how to crochet the stitch grab your yarn crochet hook give this video a thumbs up let's get to work This stitch calls for multiple of six plus two at the end. So here I have 26. All right, row number one, skip the first single crochet into the second chain from the hook, yarn over, skip the next two into the next chain. We'll put two double crochets, chain two, two double crochets chain two and two more into the same chain if i'm going too fast there is a toggle in the corner click on it and adjust the playback speed skip the next two and single crochet into the next so this is the shell and this is going to be the repeat all the way till the end yarn over skip the two into the next two double crochets chain two two double crochets one two chain two one two skip the next two single crochet into the next and the second shell repeat all the way to the end and if you followed everything correctly and uh, skip the correct amount of chains you will be left with three chains two of which you will skip and put a single crochet into the last and this is row number one now we'll turn chain four the chain three counts as a double crochet plus chain one and we'll yarn over and put a double crochet into this first stitch into the single crochet of the previous row like this chain one put a single crochet into the chain two space chain one find the single crochet and put a double crochet chain two double crochet double crochet chain two double crochet into the same stitch chain one single crochet into the next chain two space and this is how you're going to go till the end chain one go into the single crochet put double crochet chain two double crochet chain one single crochet into the next chain two space and to end this row chain one find the single crochet of the previous row and put double two oh no one double crochet and one treble oh so the chain four was a treble in the beginning oh well there we go so 
the chain four in the beginning was a treble and a double crochet and then the rest so this is what we are looking at probably with two colors will be a little better but um let's continue so turn and now we'll repeat the first row so chain one single crochet into this first stitch find the single crochet from the previous row and here we'll put two double crochets chain two two double crochets one two chain two and two more double crochets into the same space one and two then we will single crochet into the chain two space between the double crochets and this is what we have so they are perfectly on top one on top of another and you will know if you if the, the the design is moved you will know that you made a mistake okay let's move on so find the single crochet of the previous row we'll put two double crochets chain two two double crochets We stitch the two chains, we'll put single crochet in it, and so on till the end. Into the next single crochet, two double crochets, chain two, two double crochets. Okay, and here at the end of the row, you will put the single crochet into the fourth chain, like so. and there we go i like this stitch is uh it doesn't have a lot of gapping turn and now we'll repeat row number two chain four counts as a treble and putting a double crochet into the same first stitch chain one put single crochet into the chain two space chain one double crochet chain two double crochet into the single crochet right here chain one single crochet into the chain two space and all the way till the end and here into the single crochet we'll put double crochet and a treble yarn over twice insert pull up the yarn pull through two pull through two pull through two turn and now we'll repeat row number one or row number three i think row number three will probably be better since row number one was into the chains so we'll repeat rows two and three two and three all the way till you reach the desired length of the project so to start chain one single crochet into the first stitch and move into the single crochet two double crochets chain two two double crochets into the chain two space we'll put a single crochet all right i'm going to add a few rows of camera and i'll be back and i'm back so um, i've added a couple of rows as you can see so you can get a feel of how it's going to look like and here if you block it or when you block it this is what you're gonna get and for those of you who would like to change colors and uh, want to have a sneak peek on how it looks like this is what it's going to look like ideally it would be nice to change colors each row but 
I am not working that many tails and here I did it very roughly just for the example but um, yeah so this is how it looks like as a solid color and as stripes and as stripes it actually looks really good when you do two colors and has the zigzag effect um, I think I really like it so this is the right side and this is how the wrong side will look like so it will have a right side and wrong side i'm not sure if you like this type of stitches for scarves um, but for garments absolutely this will work um, even for a blanket i mean unless the person doesn't mind um, having a right side and then a wrong side and this is it for the tutorial i hope you enjoyed it we'll give it a thumbs up subscribe ring the bell all the good stuff um, enjoy the rest of your weekend I will see you next time. Bye.